under the crab, under the crab, under the crab, under the crab, under the water. Now that it's hotter, down down below. No, it's not butter. Under the water. Now that it's hotter, under the crab, under the crab. What's going on, Cancer? Hope you guys enjoyed your weekend. I mean, it's still your weekend. Happy Father's Day, by the way. <laughs> All right. All right. Cancer. What's going on with cancer? What's going on with cancer? Okay. I feel like you're disappointed over a relationship um, that just didn't grow, didn't get to the potential that you saw it to get to. You could be dealing with a Taurus. Um, I feel like um, you wanted it to go a certain way. You were deceiving yourself though because you found at the end of the day that it kept becoming more and more disappointing. It didn't work out. I feel like some of you guys could, have, could be pregnant. Some of you guys could have kids with this person. Um, this person could could have a lot of money, could have a lot of um, you know, a lot of, a lot of good qualities about them, but it just just becomes disappointing all the time. I don't I don't I don't know. I'll try to get to it. All right. I find this person here. Um, Causes a lot of the tower moments, um, a lot of the breakup. What I would say, um, this person could be the type of person to falsely accuse you of different things, different things like cheating or whatever the case may be. Um, but I feel like you want this person to stop treating you that way. You want someone to stop, you know, putting you to that break up or arguments all the time because this person here um, definitely is trying to protect their own their own feelings by telling their own truth over here with the uh, tower in reverse. I do feel like this person does want to come out of heartbreak though with you as well. This person wants to get back with you, overlook the problems, don't really address them, really, but just get back with you. Let's clarify the tower in reverse. If I this person wants to come back, but the problem is I feel like they're not addressing the issues, so it may again turn to shit, you know, turn right back to bullshit. Yeah, this person wants to take a leap of faith with you with the fool. You could be dealing with the Aries here. But the fool, like I said, they jump in without really, really, really thinking about it. So, like I said, I don't think this person's taking the time to understand why you're upset about things or why you're... Yeah, this person misses you, I think. They're looking back at you and wanting to um, work this situation out but I don't see any cards of them really. I feel like they feel like your back is turned, like you're not messaging them right now. I feel like whatever happened the last time, whatever this thing that happened, this tower moment that happened, it really, um, you yeah, know, it was like, you don't wanna, you don't wanna talk right now with this person right here. You wanna, I'm thinking you're trying to take a break because this person is not getting, getting being able to message you or whatever the case may be, or not able to communicate properly to you but they want to take a leap of faith with you. I feel like this person, like I said, doesn't, thinks their shit doesn't stink, so you know how that goes. Three of Swords in reverse. I don't see many emotional cards here, so I'm thinking, like I said, this person doesn't like to deal with emotions. I'm getting that. 
But this person here wants to come out of heartbreak. They really want, if you guys have a family together, whatever the case may be, they probably want to, they want to be with you. It is Father's Day or whatever the case may be. Um, they want to be with you and uh, reunite with you with the family. It's just the fact is that they may not be doing that right now with the Magician in Reverse, or they may be trying to manipulate themselves to get back into the situation with you by being manipulative. They want to be in the King of Ross energy, so they really just want to be with you. There's not really too much emotions behind it. I feel like they're just really, you know, stuck on their head about trying to get this thing to, you know, get off the ground with you. But like I said, they don't really want to deal with the emotional side of what's going on in this situation. So, you know, that could be the problem that's going on here. Like it just keeps going and going and going because I feel like this person doesn't want to address those issues. What other, what other things can you tell me about this person here? Yeah, this person doesn't really want to deal with emotional stuff. They just want to be with you. They just want to jump in, be the fool. Because I got the fool here twice, so you could definitely be dealing with the Aries for a lot of you guys here. Yeah, they just want to be with you. They really don't want to do the spiritual work that's needed with the high priestess in reverse. The spiritual work that's needed to really get this relationship to really, really, really work for you, Cancer. What else can we get about this person here? I feel like they just want to be with you without doing the work. person wants to open up to you definitely wants to open up to you but the problem is I feel like they want to open up to you but you're not giving them that attention that victory that they're looking for but they want to open up to you regardless let's get one more round of what what this person is thinking They want to return back to you with the Eight of Cups in reverse. Yeah, they want a relationship with you. So this person is not going to stop trying to pursue you. I think they want a relationship with you for sure. What's under the deck? They, they feel left out in the cold. Um, I feel like you feel like this is a waste of time with the seven of pentacles is not worth working on right now at this particular point i feel like maybe this relationship will also give you some anxiety or whatever the case may be let's go ahead and clarify that with the seven of pentacles <laughs> yeah you feel like you don't want to give to this because how this person has been treating you i think on an emotional level like i said there's not many emotions this person is coming to you about doesn't want to address the emotional issues I feel like you feel like that's not fair because the emotional issues are the reason why they treat you the way they treat you so you're walking away could be a temporary walk away but let's see I think you're walking away until the situation becomes more stable um, Yeah, I think that's what you're doing. Could be focused on your word. Could be trying to focus on things that are actually stable. Walking away to stability. This person here wants to put an end to something. Um, definitely they want to grow. Um, I don't know. They probably want to, you know, Reunite with you, put it into the drama, reunite with you, um, put it into the immaturity that's going on here. I don't, I'm, I'm getting that, but like I said, there's not really much emotions here. Maybe they were trying to change their behavior, want to take you out, change their behavior, get in, have a new start. I 
they don't really don't know for sure why the things are going on the way they are, but I feel like it's because they're not in touch with their emotional side. They're not in touch with their, um, you know, high priestess, you know what I'm saying? They're not in touch with their emotions. They're not in touch with their intuition about what's going on in the situation. They may feel like you're in a third party situation too as well. You could be hanging out with your friends or talking to other people about the situation. All right. They feel like you're not, they feel like you don't want to reunite with them and have a new start with them. And they feel like there's a secret behind that for whatever reason. All right. What's going to be this person's future actions towards you? King of Pentacles. Well, they feel like you're not happy right now. They feel like things are not, like they feel like you're being self-centered. Yeah, I think they want to nurture this connection, though. They want to come back in. Like I said, I feel like they might feel like there's some kind of secret that you're not telling them. They're not happy without you. So I do see a return of this person here. A lot of cards are being them returning to you. In the future, I feel like... This is not, you're gonna feel like this is not moving forward. You feel defeated in this situation. Um, you feel like this person is kind of like, doesn't get you emotionally. Um, but at the same time, you are expecting this person to reach out and try to, it, it, to message you. Let's see what's gonna happen here. Let's clarify the chariot in reverse. This person has broken your heart, and that's why you feel like it's not moving forward. This person always emotionally hurts you. Um, there's some codependency going on. I feel like you don't like that. I feel like things need to change with this person, and they need to do some soul searching for you to be able to want to come back in and um, talk to this person. The three of uh, three of swords in reverse. So it's like you want to get out of heartbreak. You don't want to be constantly heartbroken because someone doesn't understand you emotionally this person may message you but you may be a little guarded not really fully trusting what this person's motives is yeah ace of rods in reverse yeah but you still care about this person um all the all the less though even though you feel like it's not any passion behind it or anything like that um i feel like you've you connected an emotional bond with this person. All right. All right. What's the emotions behind this person that you're dealing with? How does your person feel? I feel like they want to make peace. I feel like they feel like you make them happy. Um, the only thing is they don't understand what's going on, so they feel a little discouraged, but they do want to make peace and be happy with you, though, at the end of the day. I just feel like they don't know how to do that. They're afraid that, of losing you. What about new all uprights? For, just coming in new for those who are looking for new. I feel like this old person wants to come in though if you guys have family especially they want to come and have a new start with you um they may start out with something little they might have a little gesture whatever the case may be to try to bring it together for those who are totally 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 single i feel like there's going to be a pisces or a water sign coming in to try to give you a new beginning towards your ten of cups what spiritual guides are guiding this message and what do they have to say Lady Venus, 
Truth is being revealed. Deep insights are coming from heaven in the astral realm. So things are being revealed to you about this situation. I feel like that's why you've taken a step back. Holy Alchemist, move beyond current challenges and focus on what you desire. Yeah, a lot of you guys may be pursuing um, your goals in life, things like that. You know, you have a lot of manifestation coming in. That's what this alchemy really means. Lord Geisha. Obstacles are being removed. Spiritual support and connections are increasing. So, you know, you might have people around you who want to come in or whatever the case may be and speak to you. You might get more spiritual, you know. All right. Integrity is the new black. Integrity means having your actions match your values. Most of the times, integrity takes a lot of not doing stuff, not smacking people, not yelling at people, not taking shit, not stealing stuff, not lying, not littering, not eating your roommate's last gluten-free, soy-free, vegan pizza roll. When the temptation is strong to do the bad things, sometimes it helps to write it down, the good things, and put it back in your pocket. It's hard to justify smacking someone when they have your ass pressed against the word compassion. So I don't know what you're going to do with this person. I feel like this person's not going to give up anytime soon. So if they're not speaking to you, they will be back. So with that being said, call upon the tarot gods and uh, this person or do what you want to do. If you like this video, be sure to like, share, and subscribe to this channel. I'd love to have you guys back. Thank you so much, Cancer. Bye.